Today we're going to be taking a look at some new features that are coming to NFL 4K24. If you're not familiar with NFL 4K24, it's a mod for ESPN NFL Football, also known as NFL 2K4, uh, for the PlayStation 2. And the thing that's amazing about this mod is that you can actually play it on the Xbox Series X and S via dev mode. I have a tutorial for that that I can link in the description. Uh, but you also can play it on high-end PCs using the PC SX2 emulator. Um, and we're talking, this is upscaled to 4K, and we have replaced nearly all of the textures in the game with 4K textures. Um, so it, it really does <laughs> make an amazing playing game look really good, especially when you compare it to what it looked like um, when it shipped on PS2 a really long time ago. So without further ado, let's dive into the game and I can kind of talk through what's changed between this release and the previous. All right, so the biggest difference between this release and the first release of NFL 4K24 is the addition of some portraits and cyber faces for players. This is specific for quarterbacks, star players, and mostly offensive skill player positions. You may be asking yourself, well, why didn't you just put all of the portraits and cyber faces in that you guys use in the NFL 2K5 mod that you publish? And that's a great question. I get asked that question a lot on Discord. Um, the reason that I'm not doing that with this mod is that is one of the biggest blockers for us whenever we update year over year. It's a lot of manual work and things can get broken pretty quickly. And it also does not play nice with other rosters that are created by the community. So for this mod, NFL 4K24, I'm, I run point on this mod and Lost Soul really runs point on the NFL 2K5 one. Um, and my decision for this one is we're going to keep it to star players, quarterbacks, some skill player positions to kind of make sure that Aaron Rodgers and Kyler Murray and whomever, like they look like they're themselves in the game. And I'm actually gonna jump into a game here between the, um, let me, let's pick, let's do the Eagles. Uh, yeah, let's go Eagles Cowboys. And I'll actually cycle through the uniforms here real quick and show you. So in this mod, unlike the 2K5 one, all of the uniform slots are used. So we're talking like 400 different uniforms that are always enabled and you can just go through and use, in this case, the right trigger and left trigger to change the uniform before you jump into a game uh, with no need to essentially enable that before you actually boot up. So it's much more similar to a normal console experience um, than what we're doing with the 2K5 mod. If you haven't played either of our mods, whether that's for 2K5 or 2K4, I'd encourage you to go to nfl2kmod.com. Um, that's the website that I run, and that's going to that's gonna connect you to the mods that you want. So we have an NFL mod for NFL 2K5, an NCAA mod for NFL 2K5, um, and then this one. And we're also working on a USFL, XFL, CFL, and movie mod for NFL 2K5 that will be coming later this year. Um, but yeah, like as, as we kind of load into the game, you'll see there's new afternoon sky textures, so the sky actually looks... Uh, good. <laughs> and you'll also see that there's much more detail on these uniforms than what shipped in the PlayStation 2 version. Another thing I want to highlight for NFL 2K, or I'm sorry, NFL 2K4's mod here is I've updated all the coaches um, so that they resemble their real life um, counterparts. And I've also updated all of the generic faces to use uh, better textures. Those were made by Kujo Matty. Um, which is one of the guys, if you if you follow us, like you definitely know who he is. He's amazing. Um, yeah, and the, oh, and the cyber faces were made by EGB11, um, who's been a great addition um, to, to, to some of the things that we're doing here with the old 2K football games. So I wanted to definitely give him a shout out as well. All right, so as we jump in, you'll see like Jalen Hurts and Dak, like they look like themselves, and so does CD Lamb. See, like we have new presentations, so the scoreboards branded NFL 4K24, so it's the kick meter, just a lot of little things. I made the player indicator a little more subtle, so it kind of it, it doesn't stick out quite as much. These are things that you can remove on your own. Um, I've left the folder structure of the mod where you could find where that's at. And yeah, I mean everything has changed in this, and you still get the great 2K playing gameplay. Um, with just better visuals. So this is kind of where the portraits come into play. So in this cutscene, you'll see Trevon Diggs, and it, it really does add a next layer of immersion to the mod. So I'm excited to get this out for everybody. 
Um, and yeah, there'll be more updates on this in the future. See ya.